I'm at Blackpool at the weekend and I get myself a new penis enlarger. Her name's Tracy, she's 28. <laughs> what a fucking size she was. We walked on the beach, we went, hang on, Roy, I've got a stone in my shoe. I said, you've got 20 stone in the other fucker, move yourself. <laughs> We got back to the hotel room. Eh, hey, she had a fanny like a fucking window cleaner's bucket. <laughs> I said, what do you use for a tampon? A fucking mattress. <laughs> I took my underpants off. She went, penis is small. I said, if you weren't such an ugly bastard, it wouldn't be. <laughs> you know what I said? Wear some black stockings. I meant over your fucking head. <laughs> Here, yeah, I watched her getting undressed. It was like watching two wasps fuck. <laughs> And we got into bed, she went, oh God, I wish your cock was a lot bigger. She said, I think it's died. I said, well, you wouldn't mind me burying it right up your ass then, would you? <laughs> you know what I liked about her? I'll be honest with what I liked about her, because all women are the same. When we made love, she got out of bed and give it a wash. <sighs> a lot of split asses don't do that, you know. You know, it's like lads, the next morning they want to make love again. Cool. Have you ever tried prizing open a fucking cheese toastie? 